Do you, uh, have a date for the prom? Uh, no, not yet. How about you? Well, not exactly. You know, I'm still narrowing it down. You think that, uh, I don't know, you perhaps would, uh... Slater, are you asking me to go to the prom with you? Maybe. You interested? Maybe. <laughs> Maybe pick you up at seven? No. I'll pick you up at seven. <laughs> What's wrong with it, Mrs. Slater? Mrs. Slater, if I really married you, I wouldn't use your last name. Well, whose last name would you use? Mine. <laughs> this chick's crazy. <laughs> I bet you want me to have the kids, too. <laughs> you think you have the stomach for it? <laughs> Very funny. Other things are important, too. Really, Slater? Well, sure. Trust, understanding, and great legs. Yeah. <laughs> you macho pig. Oink, oink, baby. <laughs> Zach, what do you think is the most important thing about a marriage? That's easy. Kissing. That's terrible. And not the way I do it, peach cake. <laughs> I like this. Hey, you move pretty good. Thanks, you okay too? You know we haven't fought for 15 seconds. It was 20, shut up. You know Slater, tonight's turning out to be okay. Yeah, I know what you mean. Can't wait for the prom. Kelly, we're human beings, not sex objects. I just don't want to be judged on my measurements. Why not? You got some great ones. Yeah. <laughs> Every beauty pageant just takes us one step backwards in our war against sexism. Hey, well, you can take me prisoner in that war anytime, baby. <laughs> you know what I like about you, Jesse? You throw just like a girl. Hey, why don't you just hire a man to do it? Pigs can swim. <laughs> hey, I bet Jesse would be proud to be part of an event that treats men and women equally. Right, Jesse? Well, yeah, I suppose so. Well, then why don't you enter? Yeah. Yeah, show off your inner person. All right, I will. I'm in. Right, way to go, Mama. <laughs> I mean, Ms. Mama. Hey, look, Jesse, if you're worried about that test, I'll help you study. Okay. My house at seven? I'll be there. Well, a is congruent to angle D because these alternate interior angles are congruent. Will you marry me and take the test for me? You are in trouble. <laughs> Thank you for helping me. I'll never wash these lips again. <laughs> ho, ho, ho. Well, there's only 11 girls on the swim team, so we had to put Belding's head on one of the girls' bodies. That is my body. Ugh, I'm gonna dream about Belding tonight. This was all your idea, wasn't it? You want me in a bathing suit? You got me. Oh, wait a minute. <laughs> Teen line? <laughs> I would never call one of those. Yeah, it'd be like asking love advice from someone who knows nothing about the subject. I know. <laughs> someone like you. <laughs> Hey, baby, I haven't had any complaints in the love department. You haven't had any shoppers, either. <laughs> Look, you've been on my case for the last couple of weeks. If you've got something to say, then say it. Okay, macho man, I will. First of all, I had a really good time at the prom, and I was hoping we'd go out again. Yeah, well, so did I. You never called. Well, why should I call? Remember, you walked me home. <laughs> so? So do you want to go out Saturday night? Maybe. Maybe? Maybe your blow dryer blew your brains out. <laughs> this girl's been begging me to ask her out, right? I finally do, and she says, maybe. <laughs> maybe? <laughs> hey, get rid of her. Yeah. Yeah, I will. Thanks. Jesse, about our date Saturday night? Yes? Well, forget it. It's off. Jesse, are you okay? I thought you said models, not pigs. 
Now let's put the past behind us. I mean, you guys are obviously attracted to each other. But we don't agree on anything. That's not true. See? <sighs> okay, but is there anyone you'd rather disagree with? No. no. There! Your first agreement. Build on that. <laughs> Next! Uh, this is a good time to demonstrate life-saving skills. Any volunteers? Sure. I'm an expert on mouth-to-mouth. -mouth. All right, Mama. You just... okay. Well, that's not what you said Saturday night. Okay, we begin with a romantic dinner at Cafe Diane, and then on to the ballet! Ballet? Come on, Jesse, get real. You know how hard it was for me to get these L.A. Raider tickets? Football? There's nothing romantic about a bunch of barbarians kicking each other's butts. Oh, yeah? Well, what's romantic about a guy in pink tights tippy-toeing around pretending to be a swan? You know, I should have known better than to go steady with a sexist pig. Well, go ain't going, baby, and if you don't like it, go steady with some other pig. Maybe I will. Goodbye. Jesse, what are you doing here? Well, I got this rose from Slater with a note begging me to meet him here. Wait, Zach sent me the same thing. Good evening, ladies, and welcome to the What I Should Have Said Theater. Our first play stars Jesse and Slater. The time, three days ago. I can't wait for Jesse to get here so we can plan how to celebrate our going steady. There she is now. <laughs> Oh, Jesse, you look great. What I look like is not as important as what I am, Bubba. Of course not. What a chauvinistic fool I am. I'm so lucky to have you point that out to me every day. What do you have planned for our celebration Saturday night? Football tickets for the Raiders, and they only cost me $100. But I have tickets to the ballet. Great. Who wants to see a bunch of barbarians kick each other's butt anyway? You mean you like the ballet? Oh, what does this tell you? Will you forgive us? After that, how could we not? <laughs> the glee club's not really my style, Violet. I like more active things. Football, wrestling, Jesse. <laughs> oh, look! Here's Jesse and me at Disneyland. Oh, those aren't real ears. <laughs> you know what? Jesse would love this place. Hey, did I tell you she's a great dancer? I did know. I tell you that? You showed us her kindergarten tap dance picture. Oh. <laughs> and who's this, your trainer? No. I'm Slater. I go out with your sister. Oh, yeah, you're the yacht she wrote about in her diary. How dare you, Eric? Give me that back! Give me that back! Hey, exactly what did she write about me in her diary? Five bucks a page, Curly. <laughs> I'm warning you, Eric. Give me that! Hey, did you write anything good about me after the prom there, Eric? Slater, we've got to stop this disgusting, sexist, dehumanizing auction. Hey, come on, Jesse. Lighten up. It'll be fun. Besides, you can bet on me. It's just the principle. I can't believe my own boyfriend doesn't even support me. Go ahead. Sell your muscles but I'm not gonna bid on that. About this date auction. If any one of you sweeties dare bid on my Slater, I'll hunt you down in the streets like a rabid dog. Thank you, have a nice day. Three dollars? Poor Slater, he looks so embarrassed. I bid ten dollars. I have ten dollars going once, going twice, you are promised to Kelly Kapowski. Hey, all right. <laughs> Slater, I forbid you to go out with Kelly. Hey, she bid fair and square. I guess I have a date for the dance and you don't. <laughs> Jesse, get out on the dance floor with Slater. What about us? Try to forget about me. I'm breaking his heart, Mama. Hi there. Mama's back. <laughs> uh, 
Jesse, that was great. It was great. I didn't feel a thing. Me neither. I guess we're still friends after all. Now we don't have to break up with Slater and Kelly, and we can still oh. be in the play. What a relief. I am so happy I could kiss you. Go ahead. We know we won't like it. That's right. <laughs> no. uh, wait a minute. There's our proof. Wait a minute. Don't get the wrong idea. No, see, we were just kissing each other because we were so happy we didn't like kissing each other. You skinny wimp, we're through. Okay, please. Slater, listen to me. Sometimes things aren't the hey, way they seem. Just forget it, okay, you neurotic egghead? <laughs> we're through, too. If this evil spell your kiss unlocks, we'll split the cooking and don our own socks. <laughs> Dork number five, a guy to disagree. If you want Snow White alive, don't look at me. Zach, it's not in the script. Oh. To make her boss accelerate, she needs a kiss from Dork, number eight. It's true, the prince is just a friend, but Studley for me is the living end. <laughs> it's you and Miss Studley and not the prince. Now that we've kissed, are you convinced? Uh, uh, well, at first I didn't like all of this drama, but now I trust you, so kiss me mama. <laughs> Slater, open that door. I can't. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Uh, did you open it? Uh, little, I think. You think? Oh, don't you dare get mad at me. We're only stuck down here because of you, and the prom already started. Look, I'm sorry I write the prom for you. You didn't mean to. Look, I, I'm sorry I screamed at you. You only deserve some of it. Look, um, I know we're not in the gym, and I know I'm not your date, but, well, would you like to dance? Where were you? It's a long story. With the happy ending. Last dance. This is fun. Remember all the dances we went to in this gym? Ever wish you could go back? Sure do. <laughs> when I think about all the damage we were doing to the gym floor back then, ugh, it makes me sick. Is anyone wearing their booties? For God's sake! If you're not into yoga, we beat Pacific Coast High by negative seven. What? Never mind. You want some pizza? It's not that cold. You know what? That would be great. Nice. Look. Huh? <sighs> you all right? Not really. Do you want to talk about it, or...? Not really. But this is helping. Well, um, since you got to be out of the house anyway, um, I was probably going to go to the movies or something. Oh, no, sorry, I'm going to be out of town. Renee called and asked me to come visit him in Arizona. You didn't let me finish. I was going to the movies because I have a date. Wait, you were inviting me on your date? Oh, so I guess I was also on a date with everyone else sitting in the movie theater? <laughs> Grow up, Jesse. Slater, I hate to ask you this, but can you please get over there and shut down the party? Uh. You need me to do that, like, right now? Uh, oh my god. Wait, you have your date. Sorry. Never mind, forget it. No, 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 if, if you need me. No, 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 don't be silly. Um, I'll, I'll ask someone else. I'll, I'll ask Todman. You're gonna throw away everything we have for him? Look at him! No, it, it's okay, Jesse. If you need me, I'll be there. Hey, you're home. I don't know how to thank you. <laughs> I'm so sorry I ruined your date. Don't worry about it. You know I've always got your back. Oh, it's so good to be home. Although this will never really be my home because the white man can't rightfully lay claim to any land in America. Oh, hey, Slater. Hey, Renee. Renee surprised me. He decided to come back early from his retreat. Mm. Slater, are you hungry? Renee's shaman gifted him some jerky. Well, that's not really enough for everyone. No, I'm good. Oh, are you sure? Because we got tons. Yeah, I think I'm gonna just go home. 
Wait, what is that outfit? Is it from high school? Yeah, actually it is. I've been keeping it in the trunk of my car, but <laughs> I think after tonight, I may officially be done with high school. Matter of fact, I don't think I need this anymore. 